to my channel. So for today's video, um, I decided to show uh, my book haul for the recent month and also a book review of the Herbal Trilogy which I read and finished I think for the month of this my book read during the month of June and July and August I think <laughs> okay but first let me show you my book haul so this one I got this from Shopee I forgot the name of the store. I think this is a not. I think I'll just put the. I forgot the name of the store. But. Okay. Mm. I forgot the name of the store, but this is from Shopee. Then there's a bubble again, and then we have a bulk in the figure. Feeling for and nice. Between the pages of the book is a wonderful place to. So this is the book. It's King of Scars by Labor to Go. So I. I just got this copy and actually I already have this one but I bought I ordered last two but it's not here so when I saw that there will be another sequel for this book I wanted to get it already so instead of waiting for the pre-order book I bought one and I saw this on shop actually this book is 750 but I paid 830 in Shopee because of shipping fee of course and as you all know there is an additional service charge from Shopee so I guess it's like just buying in the bookstore but again for this I think the seller is I know I I've ever heard him from Selena Fail I forget. So I'll put my own baby. So next is this one. It's from a uh, Puli Book Pasabay. So this is Crescent City by Sarah J. Mas. So yeah. And this is from uh, um, a fellow bookstagrammer in, of course, on Instagram. And then I think the star is the Pickabook PH. So guys. Then let's proceed to the book series that I read. Okay, first I don't know, but this is a hype before, and I just decided to read this because I just I just completed this year ser the series this year, but then I don't know it just. Just there in my bookshelf, and di ko siya nabasa before agad. But then ngayon, nabasa ko siya. Ayun. <laughs> and di ko akala ay na may in love ako with this series. So, in this book, this is this the Caraval series by Stephanie Garber. So, I think for the first book, super, ito yung first book niya, yung Caraval. So, it's of course, title itself, it's about a caravan. 
so ayun nga remember it's only a game it's a game actually this this book it's about um the story of a uh, two sister named Scarlett and Donatella Dragna which is um meron silang father na street then wala yung mother nila and then here's this a legendary caravan na parang nag-around kung bilis natin parang circus parang ganon and then merong game doon and then I don't wanna tell the few story para syempre baka may hindi pa nakakabasa but then yung plot niya is iikot dun sa pagpasok nila dun sa Carabal, which is very interesting. I think, nung una, parang, kasi may mga nakita ako after, I mean, nakita ko nung mababa yung rating nila dito, pero parang sa akin kasi, nagustuhan ko naman siya. Kasi bakit? Bakit ko siya nagustuhan? Okay, may five things ako nagustuhan dito. Una-una kasi tinitignan ko yung development ng character. First, yung character kasi si Miss Scarlett, parang nagsimula siya na as very, parang ano ba term? Plain girl. Yes. But at the end, hindi na siya yung Scarlett na mamimit mo sa first chapters ng libro. At the same time, yung, ano, yung, ano mo yung, kita mo yung character development. And para sa akin, isa yung sa factor kung ba't ko nagugustuhan yung book. Kung paano ko may engage yun sa character ko. Nagpa-progress ba siya? Ganon. So, yung second reason bakit nagustuhan ko itong Carabal is siguro kasi yung sister. Sa akin kasi importante, just like um, to all the boys I love before. Simple lang yung story niya. If siguro hindi dahil dun sa sister bonding dun ng tatlong mata kapatid. Yung na Largy, na Katie. Siguro hindi ako ma-indulge to finish that. But then, kasi ganon din yung sister bun. So, same with this, yung um, si Donatella, tsaka si Scarlett, parang alam mo yun yung hindi lang basta true, yung true love is makikita mo sa Prince Charming. Hindi eh. Tinakita dito sa book na to na yung true love that could possibly break her sa mga fairy tale. Eh, hindi lang basta parang yung sa magsisa, kundi sa sister mo din na mag gigit na unconditional love sa'yo. So, thank you. So, yung pangatlo, siguro is yung <laughs> magic siguro. Parang unexpected. I mean, gusto ko yung ganun na may surprise. So, naalala ko yung The Little Showman kasi that ko yung mga uh, ganun. And then yung The Little Mermaid na movie which is parang may circus din doon. Of course, I'm not preparing to the fairy tale na mask. Dito may makeup yung movie na na meron. And then yung fourth, syempre yung love interest din nila dito. I think uwa lang din ako siguro kasi parang I mean, medyo lang din. Kaya nga pang portrayal ko lang siya. Yung character dito which is Legend and then Julian. And then yung other characters na very interesting and mysterious din nila. Then yung situation kung bakit siya nagustuhan is because Um, ano matawag dito? I don't know the term, pero kasi <clears throat> yun nakaka-relate ako dun sa magkapatid. I mean, yung sa childhood nila. Kaya siguro nagkaroon ako ng connection dito. Siguro sa iba parang slow or parang ang ano nung story. But then, syempre, iba-iba yung point of view natin. So, pero dito kasi nakaka-connect ako dun sa childhood ng magkapatid. So, kaya dito kaya. Kaya, eto, parang I gave it almost 5 star. I forgot 4.8 or 4.9 stars yung main final rating ko dito. Yun. So, super love ko yung Carabas. So, next book is yung Legendary. So, itong Legendary naman, if the first book ay umikot dun sa panganay na si Scarlet, ito naman, kay Donatella, drag na naman iikot yung story. So, another, ano rin siya sa Carabal. So, pupunta sila sa Elantai. Elantin? I forgot. How to pronounce word correctly. Comment below kung tama ba yung pagka-pronounce ko nung lugar. So, dun talaga na Ben Birthday ni Donatella. At the same time, nung Empress, nung lugar na magical na lugar na yun. So, dito, maraming papasok na character. So, magkakaroon ng mga fates. So, yung fates is parang I don't know. If sa other book, parang God and Goddess siya. Pero dito kasi para siyang 
para sa ganun. Pero parang they are cursed more than God. So, may mga power sila. Pero parang, ayun, I won't tell anymore. Pero ganun yun. So, dito, madaming twist and plot. Pero, binigyan ko lang ata ito ng 4.5 or 4 stars eh. Parang ganun. Kasi, Did you know yung sara ko? Kasi parang bitin, nabitin ako na parang there could be more of that book. Kaya siguro, I mean, four stars ata binigay ko dito kasi parang may kulang talaga. Pero at the same time, sobrang ganda ng plot. Again, yung mga sisters, super gusto ko pa rin. How they care for each other, how they could um, easily um, give themselves in order to save the other one. Yung ganun na love talaga. Yun yung nag-give in talaga dito sa akin. And, of course, the love interest. Okay. For the last book is, of course, yung finale. So, for finale, ito, five stars to. And dito, kung bakit naging four stars yung legendary is because, hindi mo kasi makita yung buong plot sa legendary kasi parang ito yung half eh. Ito yung half nung story. And dito yung karuptong. So, nandito talaga yung climax ng, ng plot twist. So, parang intro. Intro dun sa plot ng Legendary. So, sobrang ganda ng finale. And then, dito ako nag-change ng bias. Kung dati parang nainlove ako dun sa 1K Julian. Kung dating sa 2, parang gusto ko na si Dante. Kung dating dito... May buluhan na ako, hindi ko na alam kung sino yung pipiliin ko. Ay, parang si, si Jack. So, pinagit ka na yung karakter. Five stars siya sa akin kasi sobrang ganda. Tapos, yung mother dito, yung mother nila, yung daw din dito. Tapos, super ganda. Alam mo yung feeling na mararamdaman mo yung pin. Actually, parang naiyak ako dun sa, may part dito na naiyak ako. Kaya, sobrang, pag ganun na pa ako ng libro, para Okay, worth it ka. Actually, natapos ko lang itong mabilis lang. Tapos super, uh, ayun, super na-enjoy ko talaga yung libro na to. So, ayun, sa mga gustong mag-recommend ng, ay, I mean, gustong magbasa nito, I think okay naman siya. Mabilis naman siya basa rin siya. Sobrang enjoy. Kung gusto nyo rin ng parang malaprosen na, ah, uh, na-end. Muda yata si Anna. Si Elsa. Si Anna and si Elsa nas magkapatid. So, yun. Pwede yun. So, actually, may hangover pa ako dito. Kaya hindi rin ako nakapagbasa after ulit dito. Ang, if may alam pa kayo na parang ganito yung story, um, makapwede ko yung i-comment down below para yun yung sunod ko na basahin. So, ayun. So, that's all for the wrap up, guys. So, Thank you for watching again and sorry kung baka kung boring kayo sa point ko pero sobrang love ko talaga itong So that's all. Thank you. That's all for this video.